Let's take a look at how we can use TI Inspire to do some calculus. You can follow along on your handheld, or you can download a free trial of the TI Inspire software from our website, education.ti.com. From a calculator screen, I can select the menu options, calculus, and I'm going to select numerical derivative at a point. So I'm going to evaluate the derivative for the variable x at x equals 2. And notice on the next line, I can either select the first or the second derivative. Let's stick with the first derivative for right now. So it brings up a template, and then all I have to do is enter my function. Let's do x squared. Hit enter. And that's the value of the derivative at the point x equals 2. I can also select the menu to bring up the definite integral, or I can also select the templates key, which is right next to the 9. And notice down here, I have the definite integral. So it brings up a template, and I can just enter the interval for which I'm going to integrate. I'll go from 0 to pi, and notice the pi key is down below next to the h. And again, my function, let's do sine of x, dx hit enter, and there's the value of the integral between 0 and pi. I can also explore some graphing. So for my calculator screen, I want to add a graph. Hit control, doc, which is plus page, and then select add graphs. I'm going to go ahead and graph a function. I'll make this 2 times sine x. And then I can also change the window or if I wanted to find the value of the integral between two points. I hit menu, analyze graph, and then number six is integral. So I can either type in my lower bound, or I can also drag using the mouse. Hit enter and then this value negative 1.09, that's the value of the integral between the two points. I could also find the derivative at certain points on this graph. Select menu, analyze graph, dy, dy, and then select a point anywhere along the graph. And the number you see here is the value of dy dx at this point. Give it a try. See what you can do using the TI Inspire.